So we combine uh, wind and solar. Um, we take the wind that goes to the building and has to go around or over it. And we take that amount that goes over it with a louver frame that goes three feet out of the building and has louvers, uh, takes in that wind, uh, makes it more laminar, so it takes out the turbulence, and then pushes it through a Venturi funnel into the turbine. And that the acceleration of the flow is between 140 and 160%, makes this turbine uh, over three times more efficient. So it has a lower cut-in with wind speed, and the higher um, wind speeds puts it higher on the power curve. Now, the area above, uh, we completely use for um, solar panels. So we're using more than 100% of the roof area. And that combined, well, a, a nice thing is, is that on a hot summer day, solar panels are actually not that efficient. But here, the wind actively cools uh, the solar panels from the bottom, so they become more efficient. It's about uh, 10 to 15%. And together now, this generates, instead of the 5 megawatt hours, it generates 30 megawatt hours per year. And then